Welcome to another Voco how-to video. In this video, we are going to show you how to set up your Voco device wirelessly using your Apple device. The first thing that you will want to do is go to the Wi-Fi settings on your Apple device and connect to the Voco configuration network. Ensure that your Apple device is fully connected to the Voco configuration network. When you see a blue check mark next to the name of the network, that signifies that you are fully connected. You can then exit the Wi-Fi settings on your Apple device. Once you exit the Wi-Fi settings on your Apple device, open up the Voco HD app. When you open the app, you will automatically be taken to the start of the wireless setup wizard for your Voco device. Hit the next button on the bottom of the screen to continue. Please wait a moment on this screen as the system is gathering information on your Voco device. When the system is done gathering all the information, the next button on the bottom of the screen will become available. When it is, tap on it to continue. On the next screen, you'll be asked to name your Voco device. We recommend that you name it something that identifies where it is in your home, for example, Living Room V-Spot. When you have entered a name for your Voco device, hit Next at the bottom of the screen to continue. On this screen, you'll be asked to select the country where you are setting up your Voco device. The default setting is the United States. Please note, if you are setting up your Voco device outside of the United States, it will need to be restarted and you will need to start the setup process from the beginning. Once you have selected your country, you will need to choose the Wi-Fi network that you will be using to set up your Voco device on, which is usually your home Wi-Fi network. To select a network, tap on the top white box and a list of available Wi-Fi networks will appear. Select your Wi-Fi network and enter your password if it is a secure network, then hit Next on the bottom of the screen to continue. After selecting your Wi-Fi network, you will be asked to select your software upgrade option. Periodically, Vocal will make updates to the software on your Vocal device, and this setting determines how your Vocal device will install those updates. If you select the Update Me Automatically option, your Voco device will download and install those updates on its own. If you select the I prefer to approve any new updates option, you will have to manually upgrade the software on your, on your Voco device when an update is available. We recommend the Update Me Automatically option to ensure your Voco device has the latest software available. When you select your software upgrade option, hit Next on the bottom of the screen to continue. The next screen will ask you to select your customer support setting. If you choose the Yes Allow Customer Service option, this will allow an authorized Voco customer support representative to log in to your Voco device remotely to, use, to assist you with any problems you might have. If you select the No, I'll take care of it manually option, an authorized Voco representative will be unable to log in to your device. After selecting your option, hit the Next button at the bottom of the screen to continue. Once you reach the final screen, select the Save option at the bottom of the screen. The lights on the front of your Voco device will begin to flash, and that signifies that the, the Voco device is configuring the settings you just entered. Your Voco device will be fully set up when you see a solid green light on the front of the Voco device itself, and in the zone screen of the app, it will say Ready underneath the name you gave your Voco device. 